All right, I'm trying to figure out how to start this video. It's an exciting day. So I know many of y'all have seen this build and this configuration for a while now. I was hoping to been have it complete. I was being very impatient. So I finally found this company. I've been eyeing their uppers for a while. And I just didn't know if I wanted to spend the money on it. So I finally pulled the trigger. On the website, it, uh, when you first enter the website, it says that uh, it talks about COVID and shipping will affect most of these orders. So it can take up to anywhere from eight to 10 weeks. So I did my eight to 10 weeks, still no shipping. No word. So I called and a lady I talked to, she told me it was being anodized and it could take maybe like another two weeks. So I waited. I waited a week. I said, I can't wait no more. I called again. It was a different person that answered the phone the second time. And he said, it'll ship out the next Friday. So that's another week. So uh, it finally shipped out. It didn't ship out Friday. I think it shipped out on a Wednesday. Today is Friday and it's here. So I'm excited. I couldn't wait to get it. I haven't even opened it up yet. I wanted to open it up, but I wanted to save it for the video. So everything is new to me. This is my first time seeing it. This will be y'all first time seeing it. I just want to get this build done and over with. I didn't put a lot of hard work in it. The build still is not fully complete because I'm going to change this uh, brace out and I'll put a uh, the, uh, SB uh, PDW brace on it. So it's going to be done as far as functionality wise, but I'm still going to change this brace out. Let's get into it. So, this is the box it came in. Pretty heavy box. Well, not that heavy, but. <sighs> Bro, y'all just don't know. I think, say, about three months of waiting, maybe. Almost three months. I don't know, too long for me, because I'm very impatient when it comes down to anything I buy or order. Stop it. Get some help. So, here we go. I can see that opening the box up. Feel like a kid in the cat store right now. Over wrap. Get that out the way. Yes, sir. Here we go. More bubble wrap. Oh, I got some patches. So the company I actually ordered this from, Special Ops Tactical. I gave him two patches. Pretty cool. Gave me my invoice. So I paid all together, let's see, I paid $779. I know I held the knife wrong with this thing. I'm just, I'm just too excited right now.
got a, a very strong smell to it. But here it is. Special Ops Tactical, 10 and a half inch Javelin Upper. And all its glory. What y'all think? Was it worth the wait? Was it worth the wait, man? Bro, I love this right now. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm loving this right now. Like, okay. So I know YouTube get kind of uh, finicky as far as like uh, putting weapons together. So I'm gonna go and snap it on the lure and we gonna come back. I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like. All right, y'all ready to see the final product? Uh, I kind of showed y'all, but uh, yes, sir. Here it is. I want to change this uh, flash hot out. This is a 10 and a half inch barrel, so I know shooting this thing will be very unpleasant with just a flash hot on there. So, y'all got any recommendations about uh, any blast diverters or uh, something that'll help? Cause I know it's gonna be uh, pretty loud. So, tell me what y'all think. My first ever build. It's finally done. I seen this, I, I just, I don't know, bro. Just, just seeing the upper just sit for all those months, bro. It aggravated me, but ah, it's finally done. So get down in the comments, tell me what y'all think. Was it worth the wait? Was it worth the money? Would you ever order anything from Special Ops Tactical? And uh, <laughs> that's it.